current population of Liberia is 4,874,000 as of 2018, based on the latest United Nations estimates. Of this number, women make up 51.1% of the population in Liberia and male, 48.9%. Also, census conducted in 2008 by the Liberia Institute of Statistics and Geo-Information Services, LEGIS, revealed that women make up majority of the country's population. Out of 103 lawmakers in Liberia, only 10 are females. That means 9 of 73 in the House of Representatives and 1 of 30 in the Senate. Women's political leadership in Liberia is a big issue and despite efforts, the data leaves much to be desired. Because these barriers will continue to hold us back. But you have st strong women who crossed the barriers. Strong women who became senators. Strong women who became representatives. Strong women who are heads of ministries and agencies in our country. Against this background, Neymut, a pro-democracy institution with support from UN Women Liberia, implemented the Young Women Mentorship and Leadership Program. NAMOT aims to ensure a ready cadre of women is available to participate in leadership, contest and contribute to increased women political participation. It aims to increase the knowledge among young women, to strategize for political processes and support the mobilization of other young people, men and women to participate in political campaign processes in Liberia. The program is focused on increasing women representation at both national and local levels and breaking barriers that affect women political participation in Liberia. The program mentored 75 young women in political leadership from across the 15 counties of Liberia. The results from the mentees have included increased appointment and elections of mentees into leadership positions at the local and national levels. Do so this way. Do so this way. That I will serve in this position. That I will serve in this position. Without any hatred. Without any hatred. So help me God. So help me God. Inclusion of mentees into national decision making processes and forum due to constant advocacy, strong collaboration between political leaders and mentees, providing training and mentorship for other young girls in school and communities. All of these actions are helping to break barriers that affect women's political participation. I am indeed grateful to Neymot for this opportunity uh, to be a part of this program and I am so happy to be elected as the president of the National Young Women Council of Liberia. Through this program I was able to establish my own uh, club in a very high school. This entire program also motivated me to become a lawmaker. I have already had the ambition of becoming the representative for my county come 2023. So this program is very important and it's very good. Neymot and 75 mentees launched and rolled out a campaign dubbed the legislature is not for men alone. has reached over 100,000 citizens in all parts of the country as part of the civic engagement component of the project. Mentees were engaged in a series of, of civic engagement activities across the country including 
town hall meetings, community dialogues, radio talk shows, coffee shop discussions, street talk, door-to-door -door awarenesses. Mentees are working to solve some community challenges that the local government is unable to solve, creating awareness on the values of democracy, women political participation, representation, gender equality, quality health and education. Some mentees are voluntarily educating their peers and students on school campuses about building self-esteem. Others mentored young girls within high schools within their communities Why others are being invited to share their experiences and lessons learned from the program to inspire other young students specifically young girls in need of guidance for their educational and professional soldier.